quote, Dan Riskin, Apophis, an asteroid that could really give us a really bad day. The time has come, the first asteroid capable of plunging our civilization into unprecedented chaos is on its approach. For the first time, NASA has to seriously prepare for an asteroid impact. For a long time, it was unclear how great the threat from Apophis really is. Now a new study shows that it will hit the Earth. How much destruction will this asteroid really bring us? And above all, where will it hit us? Canadian expert Dan Riskin is certain that Apophis will hit the Earth. It's only a matter of time. Riskin is an evolutionary biologist and a sought-after author when it comes to the fate of the Earth and our civilization. The global question is, where will we go after day X? Will the Earth really sink into chaos and change dramatically after Apophis's definite impact? We've known about this 370-meter asteroid since 2004. Apophis was originally classified as a serious threat, as earlier calculations showed a small but real probability of a collision in 2029. This warning caused worldwide concern and led to intensive scientific research. Scientists meticulously studied every available piece of information about the asteroid, but this is a difficult undertaking. Although the asteroid is large enough to give us a big blow, on a cosmic scale, it is no more than a tiny speck of dust that we have to somehow scan and observe. Asteroids do not emit light themselves. They only reflect light from the sun or from planets and moons when they fly at certain angles to these light sources. After the first warning that Apophis could hit us as early as 2029, NASA gave the all clear. An orbit correction show that we could still escape this time. Apophis is coming again in 2036. This asteroid seems to have its sights set on Earth. In 2029, Apophis will fly so close to us that it will pass under our satellites. Scientists have confirmed that Apophis will pass Earth this time without hitting it, but it is too early for relief. One uncertainty remains. During the approach, Earth's gravity could affect the asteroid's orbit in a way that makes future approaches, especially in 2036, unpredictable. Should Apophis change its orbit, we would have just under seven years to prepare for the impact. Dan Riskin is a recognized evolutionary scientist, and he warns that these uncertainties must be taken seriously. Asteroid and comet impacts have hit the Earth time and time again. They are a part of the normal cosmic life of the planet. The Earth will survive, but our society is at risk. We've been researching asteroids intensively for a long time, but can we ever really be prepared? After the initial violent impact and incredible destruction, Apophis could also cause drastic global climate change in the long term. Actually, we must not let it get that far. If Apophis is on a collision course, we must act before the asteroid hits. We would have to try to push the asteroid out of its orbit so that it flies past. However, it is still uncertain whether this will succeed. Dan Riskin has drawn up a scenario that shows that an impact in our world today would be fatal for the entire globe. The consequences would plunge the Earth into a new age of chaos and change. What does the latest NASA study say? NASA is preparing, and the best scientists in the world are studying this important asteroid. NASA's latest asteroid defense study assesses the potential threats from near-Earth objects and looks at simulations and hypothetical scenarios. The results demonstrate the urgency and challenges associated with planetary defense. This study is the first response to the growing concerns about the Apophis asteroid but we need to go further. Lindy Johnson, the director of NASA's Planetary Defense Office, emphasized that we need as much information as possible about the size and orbit of asteroids to avoid practical problems caused by uncertainties. The study and exercises clearly show that there are still significant gaps in international preparedness for such potential disasters. As part of an extensive hypothetical exercise, NASA simulated an asteroid that initially remained undetected due to its orbit around the Sun 
and is on a collision course with Earth. This fictitious asteroid was large enough to cause considerable regional damage in the event of an impact. The simulation showed gaps in the global community. Nations that are currently in dispute and discussion, or even at war with each other, would have to cooperate with the rest of the world and hostile camps on this one point. We do not yet know how a defense should be practically financed. Here too, the international community must stick together because we might have to send several probes to push Apophis out of its deadly orbit. If all attempts were to go wrong, we would still need to have enough resources to prepare the planet and people for the consequences. The results of the NASA exercise were alarming. The exercise showed that humanity is currently ill-equipped to avert such a catastrophe. Despite a hypothetical warning time of 14 years, we need to get a move on if we want to save our world. What is certain is that Apophis will not be the only asteroid to threaten us. There will be others. In the worst case scenario, one of these chunks could appear without much warning and then the impact would be unavoidable. What exactly does Apophis look like? It's scary that a 370 meter chunk flying around out there will cross the Earth's orbit several times over the next 100 years. Most of the time, however, we don't actually see Apophis. Our modern telescopes can detect asteroids using the finest technologies, but we don't have a clear picture of the asteroid. Officially known as 99942 Apophis, this asteroid is still a big mystery. And as Lindy Johnson emphasized, we need more information. NASA is already on its way. The OSIRIS probe is currently on its way to Apophis and will bring us valuable samples from the asteroid surface back to Earth in a few months. If we want to successfully push Apophis out of the collision orbit, we need to know more about the asteroid's exact composition, density, and weight. Apophis probably originates from the asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter. This reservoir of billions of rocks which date back to the early days of our solar system, can shoot asteroids in our direction at any time. Researchers have found that in a few decades, Jupiter may occupy a position within the solar system that gravitationally affects the asteroid belt in such a way that dozens of asteroids could suddenly fly towards the Sun. These predictions once again impressively demonstrate how urgently we need to prepare. Apophis is currently moving in an elliptical orbit around the Sun, which regularly brings it close to the Earth. The most critical approach will take place on April 13, 2029. During this approach, the asteroid will pass about 31,000 kilometers above the Earth's surface, about a tenth of the distance to the Moon. During the approach, Apophis can fly through a special constellation of the Earth's gravity, and if Apophis hits this keyhole, the probability of an impact in 2036 is 75%. Apophis is coming. What could happen? An Apophis impact could have devastating consequences depending on the impact location, whether on land, in water, or in a densely populated or sparsely populated area. In the following, we take a detailed look at the possible scenarios of an Apophis impact and their effects on the Earth. If Apophis were to hit the ocean, which is likely due to the Earth's large water surface, the immediate impact would be enormous. Such an impact would vaporize a huge amount of water and trigger a massive tsunami. This tsunami could reach wave heights of several hundred meters and inundate coastal areas with a radius of several thousand kilometers. Towns and villages along the coastlines would be at risk and infrastructure would be severely damaged. Imagine how many industrial plants, ports, airports, expensive villas and vacation resorts directly on the coast would be destroyed in one fell swoop. The impact would also throw large amounts of water vapor and other particles into the atmosphere, causing the Earth to experience periods of darkness and stark climate changes. The evaporation of water and the release of aerosols could cool the global climate, similar to a volcanic winter we would have to expect crop failures for years and the global food supply would be at risk. We therefore not only need probes in space, 
but also alternative concepts for agriculture that can continue to function independently of external conditions in an emergency. An impact on land would cause a massive explosion, comparable to the detonation of several nuclear bombs. The energy released would leave a gigantic crater several kilometers wide. The pressure wave and the heat of the impact would destroy everything within a radius of many kilometers – people, animals, forests, and buildings. In a sparsely populated area, such as the desert or the Arctic, the immediate human losses would be small, but the environmental consequences could have a significant global impact. Our planet is a sensitive ecosystem. The effects would probably change the direction of the globe and our climate forever. An impact in a densely populated area would be the most devastating scenario. In a metropolis like New York, Tokyo, or Mumbai, an impact would claim millions of lives and destroy an entire city. The infrastructure would collapse completely, including the power supply, water supply, and communication networks. The economic damage would be immeasurable and the survivors would face a humanitarian crisis. The long-term consequences of such an impact would also be catastrophic. Survivors would have to deal with the effects of fires, toxic gases, and possible radiation exposure. The release of pollutants into the atmosphere could affect air quality worldwide and cause health benefits everywhere. An impact off the west coast of the USA was briefly predicted for 2029. This would mean that cities such as Los Angeles, Seattle, and San Francisco would be destroyed by a gigantic tsunami. The impact could also trigger a chain reaction at such a sensitive location and cause the San Andreas Fault in California, for example, to break open. If the asteroid hits Europe, the volcanoes in Italy could erupt as a result. An effective early warning system enables us to take measures in good time to minimize the effects of an impact. However, the evacuation of millions or billions of people from endangered areas and the construction of protective infrastructures will still require a lot of preparation, as NASA showed us with its latest study. Subscribe to the channel now and be part of every new video.